that. Okay, so the players are Kubais, Roa, Bergi, and Aona on this one. As we are going into... Oh my god, dude. Kubais with the Trickster 305. It is actually Roa who takes the lead right now. Aona struggling a lot. He said he knew the map, but the, clearly it doesn't look like he knows the map. Here we go with Roa up in the jump. Let's see if he's going to make it. Yes, he does. Goes for the flip into the instant respawn. We have Bergy also making it. Kubai's getting stuck. Roa gets uh, the CP bump. I mean, finish bump. And Kubai's actually jumps a little bit too far. Finds himself in the respawn once again. It is 10 points to uh, Roa. Poker Meister. 6 points. Kubai's 4. And the person who said he knows the track is in last. Didn't even finish. Here we go then. Borgi is looking strong on this one. Gets an early landing. Finds himself in last place. Okay, let's see. Oh, Borgi has to respawn. We see Roa again. Getting up on the top of the tippity top. But Aona gets a lot more speed now. Kuba is in hot pursuit. Aona is in first, but he gets a terrible. He gets stuck. He is full stuck. Same with Borgi, who finds himself in the stucking. But it is Kubais, the Sumpy manager, getting 10 points. Roa, 6. Borgi is getting third, most likely. And who is not able to finish? The person who said he knows the track. Zero points for a owner. Ah. Roa in first. A owner in second. Let's have a look at Aona. Oh, Aona is going for a safe strat now. Bergy. I don't know what Bergy was doing there, but uh, finds himself back in last place. Had to respawn. It is Roa up in the lead. Kubais in second place. Aona in uh, third. Here we go then for the next try. Oh, he gets a respawn. It is Roa. Oh my god, Bergi. I don't know what kind of strategy that was, but... Tries to go for a bug fin. Gets last place here, actually. Kubais, 10 points. Ro I mean, Ioner in second, Roa in third, and Bergi in last. Alright, last round on this map. Everyone making the start besides Roa. Roa is in the back seat. Is it Friday yet? No, it's not. It's Thursday. So Aona is leading this one. He needs a 10 pointer here. Roa still stuck in the start. I don't know why, but uh, he is uh, struggling a lot. A Aona gets stuck. Kubais gets stuck. Borgi. Gets the backwards. Ultimate BM, dude. 10 points. Unbelievable. S club. Aona is actually getting last place here. Two people did not finish. Oh. However, Kubais is leading. All right, what do we have here? Dude. Oh my god. Holy tits, dude. That is a sick map. The 
<laughs> Zero points for Norway. All right, let's have a look at the start here. <laughs> Why didn't Bergy just PF? It's just a PF start. Oh, it's clearly not a PF start. I take everything back that I just said. Aona will get the first point here. Actually... Oh my... <laughs> Are you kidding me? <gasps> oh my god. Okay, he still gets first. Greatest run ever. Oh. Borgi doesn't know how to bug slide. But that's alright. Oh my. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell is going on, dude? Holy shit. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> Just save it, Bergy. Oh, here comes Kubais. Oh, he gets it. He gets the 10 points. Oh my god. Oh. <laughs> Nobody. Yeah, besides Aona. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Dude. Oh. I don't know if I have energy after that, dude. Oh, Roa is taking a little bit of a different approach, and he dead. Dude! Sick stuff by Aeona right here. Bergy is just going normal. Oh my days, Kuba is with a lot of speed here. Oh wow, dude! Roa with the bug slides. But it's all gonna depend on Aeona's end. Oh no. Oh my god. Is Bergy. Oh, he gets it. Bergy gets the 10 points. Oh no. And Aeona gets. Dude, Aeona is so unlucky. Oh my god. Holy moly. It... Let's watch Roa actually. Oh, here goes Roa. Oh, he gets the bug slide. Oh my god. Dude, Roa is in first by a second. Let's go to the players behind him. Let's let's see if Roa is gonna gonna make this one though. Oh my God, Yawola! There's finishes on the right. That is Pog, Pog. Good shit, man. There we go. Kuba is still in the lead though with 62 points. We're moving on to the next track. Mat Lol 5.
Okay, maybe you gotta, like go here. And then you get the booster. I see. Very low. All right, short map here, 12 seconds. See what these guys will uh, do here. There is the booster right there, so. Let's see. Oh, Roa with the delayed start. Ro Roa with the delayed start here. Borgi in first, and Borgi gets the 10 points. Aona getting 6 points. That is good for his uh, total points because he is on uh, 19 right now. I mean, it is uh, a steep gap, but, you know, still possible to uh, catch up. All right, let's take a look at Roa. Oh my god, that was really close. But Roa snipes the 10 pointers. Kuwais seem to be struggling here, so... He will lose a tremendous amount of points compared to the other players. Let's see here then. Okay, the gap between Kubais and Borgi is 10 points. Let's have a look at Kubais for this last round. I mean, second last round. Oh my... <laughs> Both of them foo in the pillar ruski. It is Roa getting another 10 pointer, but Kubais is really getting the worst on this map. He keeps getting last and last and last. That is really not good. Roa, however, has taken 23 points so far on this track. So last round, Aona finds himself against the pillar. This is really important for Kubais to get more points here. Oh, and he does. But it is actually uh, a draw between Roa and Bergi going into the next track. Let me just check one thing here. What the heck? Whoa, intro. Snorix presents... God bless you. Whoa. Whee. Whoa. Sick intro, dude. Sick intro. Oh my god. We have like more contrast. Thanks for playing. The hell is this camera, dude? Give me this back. Okay. Oh. Looking like a nice technical track right here. With a buble. <clears throat> Jason Buble is also there. Oh, Roa cannot get the finish. Wait, what? There is a second finish. There is a second finish on the left. Maybe people will figure it out in this first live round. But uh, let's take a look at the points there. 78 for Kubai, 67 for both Roa and Bergi. And Aona with 32 points. Here we go then. Very close battle here. Oh, Bergi has to slow down a lot. He did not make a mistake yet. Kubais did, however. Oh, no, Bergi. Oh, loses a lot of speed there with the poor transition. Roa managing his speed very well. And he will have enough speed for the finish line. Same with Bergi. Let's have a look at uh, Kubais. He does also have enough speed. But it is Aona who is uh, finding himself once again in a no finish situation
All right, then. Here we go. Aona really needs to step up his game. Oh. Struggling a little bit. Oh, but Kubais is the person who struggles a lot. Drops down to last place now. It is a battle between Roa and Bergi. Okay, Roa getting a lot of speed here, but Bergi is still in the mix. Bergi goes for a little bit of a wider approach. Get more speed on this stretch. It's all going to be decided in the finish line. It is Bergi getting the best of it. And what a battle. He even throws the tantrum in the chat. Wrecked. 10 points to Bergi. So, they will be equal in points again. But it's really close for the top three right now. Let's have a look at Kubais. Kubais getting a nose slide. No slide de merde, as we call that. It is once again a battle between the ages. Roa versus Bergi. Roa getting a lot of speed, but he misjudged his jump completely. Flies out of the map. And it is Bergi now up in first. Kubais in second. Will it stay like this or not? Will they have enough speed for the jump here? Yes, they do. And it is going to be Bergi in first. Kubais in second and Aona in third. Will Roa be able to finish? Nope. Roa is dead Musmit. Dead Musmit. One more track. Here we go. One more round, sorry. Okay. Roa really seeking to get those 10 points. Oh, big mistake by Bergy right now. So this is really good for... Uh... Oi, 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 for Roa. But he finds himself with a huge mistake. So this is going to be Kubais getting 10 points. And oh, no. Aona can't even get the respawn here. Has to back it up. Let it in. Let it begin. And it is Kubais getting 10 points. That is going to be really good for his total. However, Bergi getting second. Is also really good. Because the gap stays at 3 points difference. We're moving on to the next map. This is... MSC Duracell. Great track right here. Made by a Frenchie. As you can see, map is looking French. I mean, doesn't have a lot of block mix, so. Oh, Bergy is doing an extra looping just because. Okay. Seems pretty easy. Alright. Okay, not too bad. Some nice slides. Wow, even uses smoothening blocks. <laughs> Why? <laughs> what? Why would you full speed that? Uh, getting a little bit annoyed by my headset today. <sighs> All right, here we go then. Round number one. Let's follow Roa for this first one. Okay, good stuff by everyone. Wow, what a turn by Bergy. Look at him go. Oh, Roa is going too wide. Bergy is collecting all the speed that he can. But Kubais remains ahead. Oh no, Bergy tries his best. I even think Aona might have a, have a go at him for his second position. But uh, Aona with some terrible slides 
will remain in uh, last place. 10 points for Kubais. Ergi with 6, Aeona 4. And uh, Kubais is really looking strong here. <coughs> Kubais needs one more win in order to get to finalist mode. Will Kubais actually win his very first battle of the weeps? Big IQ plays, but it did not work out. Massive IQ plays by Aeona did not work out. Kubais will receive finalist mode if he manages to finish here. And he does. Ay ay ay. This is looking incredibly good for Kubais. Ooh. Let's have a look. Here we go. Is everyone going to deny Kubais? He gets an insane start. Oh. Roa attempts the shortcut as well. I think this is gonna be over and out right here. It is looking like Kubais will just sweep over these fellas. Oh, Aeona is really trying his best. But it is still Kubais in the lead. Aeona with a bad slide as well. And that is going to be GG here. One slide remains for Kubais. And he will take it. GG. Well played. Unbelievable. He wins his battle of the weeps. In cold-blooded fashion. Wow, we. What a mad lad. Thank you for subs. Insane. Thank, thank you, sir, sir. Who is going to get second? Here we go. Hello there, Durstos. Thank you for the Twitch Prime sub. Okay. Bergy really uh, wanting these 10 points, but Aeona seems to be uh, up in first with a lot more speed. Ooh, we have a good battle here. Oh no, I saw that coming from 10 miles away. Ooh, Roa with a lot of momentum here. Oh! Aye! Full stop. He gets a full stop in the checkpoint. That is definitely not a good place to crash. This is going to be Borgi getting 10 points here. We'll put him up to 119 points. And then we are going into the next map. Okay, okay. Decent time. By Borger. Let's have a look here. What the next map is going to be. Will it be a good one? Or will it be a good one? This is definitely a good one. I can already tell. <laughs> look at look at Bergy. <laughs> Wait, what the hell? Yo, sick camera, dude. It's like a roller coaster right now. Wee! <laughs> Yo.
Yo, you gotta turn, mate. <laughs> you got, <laughs> you gotta turn. Okay. Here we go. <laughs> <laughs> Let's have a gander here. MMC. Bergy with 119 points. He just needs to reach the finish line. We have a wonderful overview here by everyone. Oh, Bergy is struggling a lot. All right, let's have a look at Roa, who finds himself in his... Uh, Cockpit. Wait, where are the others? Okay, okay. Roa doing good here. Roa is so far ahead. Oh, he crashed a little bit. Oh, Bergy is struggling a lot, grinding the walls. Same with Iona. <laughs> oh. Roa still looking to take the 10 points here. We could potentially see a two-way finalist getting uh, made on this map. But it is definitely looking good for Roa. Oh yeah, baby. He's going ham. Bergy just needs to finish. I wonder if you can just wall bang right there and then, you know, pop it, let it bang. Okay, 129. Whoa. Fred finalist. Oh my god. Fred is finalist, guys. Is he going to do it? Is he going to do it? All the pressure is on Frederick Bergyman, the poker master from Unibet. He makes a mistake already. Same with Roa. Aona is all in first to deny. Bergy sliding, wall banging. Check. Goes for a nice line here. Check. Full stop. Check. Retire. Check. Roa is going to take 10 points here, most likely. It could also be Aona making the comeback. See here. Okay. Good response. Wow. He improved his fastest time in lap one. That is pretty good. Oh. No. Aona was looking good. But oh, Roa has made a mistake as well. And now Aona is hugging the wall. And now... oh. Okay, Roa gets it really well here, actually. Insane job by Roa there in that section. And he will definitely set a nice time. Wow, look at the top. He has been driving for 80 hours, guys. Insane. Roa has the stamina of a bull. Incredible performance. 42 seconds. 41 seconds. Ooh. We almost have double finalists. Hundred and twenty points. Let's see if Bergy is able to get the victory right now. Here we go. Oh. Oh my god, he's actually going for it. Eee! Okay, we have a battle right now, boys. They are all within 0.5 of a second within each other. Bergy is gonna overtake for that second place. Yes, he doesn't make a crash. He needs to make sure he turns at the correct section. Nice, well done. Now it is still Roa in first. Here comes the respawn. Oh... This is going to be really tight. Lap number two. This is the lap where Roa has been struggling quite a lot. Bergy sets an incredibly fast time. 43 seconds. Bergy actually with more speed on this first magnet part. Oh my god. He is shaking. He is not crashing. I thought he crashed for a second. But no, he goes a little bit wide. Now he gets the slide perfectly fine. Goes super tight. Can he still uh, remains there? No, he makes a full crash. And that is going to be Roa. 
getting the 10 points here, most likely, because Pokermeister Bergy is super far behind. And Roa is in first. We're gonna go to the next. Oh my god, the ultimate BM by Roa as well. Goes in the finish backwards. Here we go then. The f what most likely will be the final round. Here we go. Roa versus Bergy. Okay, all players are really close. Bergy is actually leading. He actually makes a mistake, but I don't think this will hurt him that much. No, that one will hurt, and that one hurts even more. This is looking really good for Roa. Where's Aeona? Aeona is in second place. He is a full second behind. So this is all up to Roa to throw away. Will we see Throa rise up from the ashes? Or is it going to be Roa that we will see here? It's looking like we are seeing Roa. Definitely. <laughs> this Bergy. <sighs> this is definitely looking like Roa is going to take it. Wow, world record. GG, dude. A new world record. That is insane. He actually sets a new world record. Alright, the winner is Kubais. Roa gets second. Bergy in third. And Iona in third. Thank you for subs. Thank, thank, thank. Whoa. Hi. Carl Jr. with a 40 month resub. That is insane. 